welcome back to In the Garden with Greendell. Today I'm going to show you how to make a really super easy and fun arrangement for your front porch using sticks and things found around the yard. What I have here, we're going to follow along with the same kind of idea that we do with our wines and vines um, events that we have in the spring and summer where we have a container, it's a container garden party, and we start with thrillers, fillers, and spillers for our planter arrangements. So that's the basic idea that we're gonna be using today for our um, front porch arrangement. I have some things that I picked up out in my yard. I have thrillers, those are gonna be my sticks in the background, twigs, just found them on the ground. Fillers are going to be my pine branches, and then fillers are my spruce branches because they're a little bit fluffier. The only thing I have that is store-bought is these glitter twigs, which you could make yourself by putting some glue and glitter on. And then I have these um, twigs that have red berries on them because I don't have any plants that have red berries on them this time of year. So nothing outside does that for me. I also have some rocks that I'm going to put in the bottom of my planter so that it doesn't blow away or knock over um, outside. So just some enough rocks to make it heavy enough to stand upright. And then I have an old galvanized um, planter here and I could have used my planter that I had for the wines and vines too, if you have one of those lying around. Uh, I also have some florist foam just to help with stability for my arrangement. So uh, with that, I'm gonna get to work and you can watch along. Christmas tree. Here's the finished product. Didn't take any time at all. I took a nice little walk outside, got some things off the yard and in the, out of the trees. I did a little bit of trimming on the branches in order to get them so they're more stick-like to put into the arrangement. And then I just played around with it, started with my thrillers, and then I put in some spiller fillers, and then some more spillers, and then some other thrillers. So hopefully you get a little bit of time this holiday season to take a walk outside in nature, get some branches and things to make your own personal beautiful planter for your porch. We wanted to thank everyone for their liking, sharing, and tagging a friend last time. 
Julie Fields from Mooresville was our winner. So uh, thanks so much for all your watching this year. This is our last video of 2019. So we will see you in 2020. And I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful holiday season. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. And I'm going to go take my planter out onto my porch. Merry Christmas.